Mm-hmm. Dalawa silang nation na nagprint ng pera, they are all dead. Uh, the Marcos that they have known since 86 is a clone. Okay? Mm-hmm. So, nga, pag- so, so, that's the thing. Na interesting yan, interesting. Maraming 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 salamat po sa walang sawang pagtangkilik at pagsuporta sa The Filipino Times featuring the Divine Legitimate Government, Kingdom Philippine Hacienda, the Sovereign Host Nation. Kami po ay lubos na nagpapasalamat sa walang sawang pagsubaybay sa aming mga programa sa pagsiwalat ng katotohanan. Nao po tayo po ay magkaisa para po sa isang layunin upang maitaguyod ang inang bayan bilang isang makatao, makajos makabansa at makakalikasan, malaya at nagkakaisa. Maraming salamat po. Kamunata. Para maunawaan natin itong ating tatalakayan dahil malalim-lalim ito. Basta pagdating sa Kingdom Pilipina Hacienda, ha? eh malalalim ang mga tanyatalakay at uh, dahil talaga dinadaan nila sa legalidad, ano? Ang kanilang uh, isinasagawang pagsulong dito po sa mga karapatan. O, karapatan natin, ta- karapatan natin. No? Kaya ta- importante na maunawaan natin ito. O, tsaka um, ano rin po ako sa hanga po ako dun sa Kingdom Pilipinas Hacienda dahil malawak at malalim mong kaalaman sa batas. O dito po sa screen, ito makikita po natin dito sa screen. Dito po napukaw yung aking atensyon. Kaya po sabi ko eh, panahon na para magkawin sa puli kami ni Queen Salvacion, Ligas P.E. Espiritu Santo at nang maipaliwanag po ito sa publiko. Dahil meron inisyo na lang sulat ng February 26 ito, no? uh, taon 2019. Naka-address ito sa Commissioner uh, Ray Leonardo Guerrero, Bureau of Customs, Gate 3 Port Area. Siguro kaya nasunog yung Bureau of Customs building, ha? <laughs> so, sir, dito sa baba. Uh, of the Treaty of Paris, ratified Article number 9, noted I uh, have the right to retrieve all files, archives, global, especially the World Settlement of the United Secret Book of Redemption of the Federal Reserve System. So medyo malalimulin ito, hindi ko masyadong maunawaan. Kaya mamaya tatanungin natin sa kanya. So dito, uh, pinapa, tinatanong niya, o oh, ito ba isang inquiry, uh, na, I demand your good company brings in the Banco Central of the Philippines with the respective office responsible on the delivery to the unknown recipient to indemnify such laws immediately. Kumbaga no, malaki pala na wala sa bansa. Uh, as regards to the 400 AU gold pallets, which are considered a divine wealth, you are hereby ordered to retrieve them and surrender the same to the undersigned with dispatches. We all know these treasures returned to the country had been, has been uh, looted by the criminals of the system. So may karoon yata ito. So pa dito eh, parang may breach, no? May breach. Kaya siguro eh, tatanungin natin si, si Queen Salvation na nasa linya na natin ngayon. Ano po ba ang nature ng sulat na yun, uh, May Queen? Alam mo, uh, ang nature sa sulat na yan is actually the final and executory. That is the highest level of uh, executory in regards to uh, the land rights, uh, the, gold, the printing of money, Uh, these are all the inclusive na, the in, uh, pinaka-mataas-taasang uh, instrumento na ipapamahayag natin sa mga nakaupo dyan sa ating pamamahalaan. At hmm. itong uh, Alodial and Cabay title, hindi lang ito pinaisyo natin sa Pilipinas. Actually, uh, we also forwarded this to the other foreign nations like Russia, Singapore, uh, Deutschland, and now we are actually expanding it to other countries. Okay. So, yan po ang pinaka mataas na um, enforcement requests 
kasi ito kasing uh, alodial at saka kobeit uh, kung sino man ang actually na naghahawak sa mga for example niyang mga looted accounts like the euro dollar that was shipped in the Philippines then it was actually um conspired corrupted looted ay wako ko ano niyo sasabihin uh, uh, it got out in the system it was never in the system but it was stolen even before it got in the system that is the problem and because of this mm. we are trying to retrieve it since the shipment of the gold and also the euro dollar is uh, actually unknown so hindi nila alam kung sino recipient so it's an unknown recipient meaning to say uh, wala talaga nakakaalam so ang akala siguro ng banko central is it could just be anyone who is in power then they can go ahead and just take the gold but the problem we have is actually it goes it goes in the wrong hand yan ang problema po uh, ka ka Anton so itong na consummate ba ito kailan ng panahon ni Noynoy Aquino no uh, actually no, this was lang... this 631 pallets and 431 boxes of euro dollar was actually shipped uh, in the time of Pinoy, yes, uh, 2013. So since 2013, itong pallets of euro dollar already arrived here in the Philippines with an unknown recipient kasi hindi nga alam unknown because it's an apocryphal. And according to the civil case 3957P, the owner is also lost owner. This is where the whole thing actually nga nagkaluko-luko ang sistema regarding claims of these accounts, claims of the land. Ito ang nakakos ng problema sa bansa at sa buong mundo po. Hmm. So, paano niyo po napag-alaman na may ganitong uri na kumbaga smuggled? na na-smuggled out of the country. May nag-supply you ng intelligence? Very good question. Kasi ang totoo, alam ko na rin, narinig ko na itong uh, Wealth of the Nation, TBM, TBM 666. These are all the wealth that was looted in the time of Marcos. Mm -hmm. uh, naging LSM 666, TBM L, uh, TVM 666, itong account na ito under the, the regime of Ferdinand Marcos. And these are all monies that was uh, rented under 1950 sa bilateral mines field. Alam ko na itong bilateral treaty na pinirmahan in the time of uh, President Quirino, in the time of Quirino in 1950, before it was actually shipped, uh, signed to be rented to the World Bank, President Elpidio Carino came to Iligan City and made city of Iligan the first charter city in the Philippines. So Iligan City becomes the first loan district charter city. So, ito yung Kadasli 292. So, after the, the declaration of the Lone District here in Iligan, then when he came back to Manila, he signed the Bilateral Agreement Treaty for 50 years. These are the gold in the Central Bank that was borrowed by the World Bank to print money globally. Somehow, the, the gold is actually protected under the Constitution of 1935 and also protected under Civil Case 3957P. This was 
actually under the Federal Research System, 1776 ended 1976. Then in 1976, um, the Federal Reserve Bank requested a 33 years extension. And to sum it all, it ends up in 2006. 2006 was actually also the end of the demonetization of the Federal Reserve System on the demonetization of all the accounts global. And in the book of redemption of the Treaty of Paris, under the redemption of the Federal Research System, uh, according to the book, March 21, 2006, was also the demonetization of the account. That's one reason why 2016, the, the notes were, were already all um, demonetized, devaluation, and this is what causes the Third World War and also civil war because of the, uh, the, uh, the, current, the currency, the, the sovereign debt was already being recalled. So all these monies, actually came to the Philippines, Banco Central, in their bonded warehouse. And you were right. Kaya nga itong lahat, dahil nirecall na, ukuni na ng may-ari sa ginto at sa yaman ng bansa. Kaya nasunog ang kostom. That's the reason why Last yeah. February 23, I believe, mm -hmm. uh, Bureau of Custom was under fire. Nasunog yeah. ang ating Bureau of Custom again to, uh, to cover up the sabotage, the conspiracy. In mm -hmm. fact, I was told, I was actually texted by one of our associates that in this Olodial, in this claim, there were five already died, including... Governor Banco Central. There was another one that was mentioned who died. His name was Paul Bartolasso, also died. He was actually addressed in this declaration on 4th of January 2019 regarding the status of the euro dollar and other commodities in their possession and control. You know, um, this is the problem right now. And because of this, we declared indemnification. And we also de uh, declared from Brinks that mm. since we cannot locate the, the euro dollar, and in fact, not just euro dollar, we already tried to also trace, including the Zimbabwe, uh, the, the dinar, the Zimbabwe, and all others I know, it's all in the bonded warehouse. And it is in the hands of a very few. And this is what causes the Third World War. Because if this was actually, we're able to redeem and claim, we couldn't have the Third World War. We could have saved already the civil war here in the Philippines, the poverty. And because of this, we declared it as a total loss. And that nobody could utilize or use this currency that is floating nationwide and global now, that all the currencies are now demonetized, declared by the sovereign crown, Kingdom Filipino Shenda the legitimate government that possess the civil case 3957P, the OCT 01-4. And there's always a connotation, who owns the land owns the gold. And uh -huh. since the Republic of the Philippine Corporation failed to promulgate the constitution, this is the reason why 
the country suffer. Kingdom Filipinas has declared one world government. You never can declare one world government if you have no territory. Because the territory mm. makes government. Mm. And that's one reason why Republic of the Philippines was actually awarded the original certificate, uh, original constitution. And we have the original certificate title, which is the OCT 01-4 which was consolidated under the royal crown in 1764, time immemorial. And that's one reason why FPRA 8371 in section 56 is actually a right of time immemorial as far back memory reaches. And this memory reaches we're talking about is actually the creation. This is okay. God, the creator God. Okay. Now, um, tungkol po dito, balikan po natin itong uh, sulat ninyo, liham ninyo. Marami pa pa yung pinadala ninyo, itong uh, indemnification. Uh, demand yes. of indemnification. Ibig sabihin eh, humihingi po ba kayo, ng, humihingi tayo ng danyos doon sa pagkawala yes. ng uh, uh, yes. Euro dollars at nung yes. 400 uh, pallets of Tama gold. Tama yan. Okay. Bakit? Now, ano, ano naman mo naging sagot sa inyo? Ano naging tugon sa inyo? We ng Bureau just Post actually, ang, ang nangyari, that's why la, ang buong mundo ngayon, even the central bank, sila lahat ngayon, everything is panicking. If you hmm. listen to other YouTube, they already start giving all the clues. And you are the only um, YouTube producer that actually I speak to that we actually reveal to them that mm. the sovereignty is the holder and the redeemer, the successor, hereditary successor in interest under the patrimony of the nation that is in the preamble of our constitution, Article 1, and this is the owner the holder and so the owner of the go or the owner of the land is the owner of the gold, the gold. Okay. and only the owner of the land and the gold actually can print currency and in mm -hmm. our amendment in the promulgation of the 1987 constitution article 18 section 26 that the ill-gotten wealth is a divine wealth. That's right, that's so right. If, yes. So if you can see it, in the beginning of our constitution, the preamble is the prayer, the supreme law of the land. The mm. preamble is the prayer. And as in the prayer, all government official took an oath to defend and promulgate the constitution. And they fail. And because of this, because of this, our country is doomed. So, yun ngayon ang timeline. When we're talking about government, from the hierarchy, the last time the Philippines was under hierarchy, civil government was 1976. Then given 10 years for turnover, 1986. So meaning after that, 1986, we become a corporation. So this corporation, we become a de facto, mm -hmm. de facto government, a corporate government administrator. So our administrator is not a real government employee. They are corporate. Mm, that's right. You name yeah. part of the administration. And so, meron ba kayong amount na involved? Meron ba kayong estimation kung magkano itong lahat? Yung mga na-ship out na yan? Uh, ang, ang euro dollar itself is 27 billion dollars. Uh -huh. uh, ang hulog yata ng per pallet out, 100 million per pallet. Think about this, ha? Uh, 100 million dollars per pallet and there is 631 pallets altogether. Uh, 
I was even told one pallet was taken out uh. in 19, in 2016 election by by the Aquino. Hmm. Grabe, grabe. You know? Grabe talaga. Okay, so uh, napakaganda nung rebeli yung itong ating napag-uusapan tungkol nga dyan sa nawawalang uh, bulto ng euro na sinip out at wala nang magkakilalan o ma wala na tayong trace kung saan nga atin ito ma makikita pa o kung makikita pa nga muli. No? Kaya uh, maganda itong inyong binuksan at inyong ginagawa. E eh, sana eh, mapakinggan naman at matugunan. Alam so, mo, alam mo uh, kasi Canton, only the words of God, only the scripture is the one protecting me where I get confidence. As God said in Revelation 17, 17, God said, mm -hmm. For I will put my will in the hands of the beast until oh. it's fulfilled. And then on mm. the other hand, in Zechariah 4, 6, God also said, You will win, not by military might, nor by your own strength, but by my mm. spirit. And what is the spirit? The word of God, the covenant, the constitution. And mm. because of this, everybody will be nailed down to the ground. And, and, uh, and everything, the ground zero, the timeline. And we are now in the timeline we're in. God's anger now mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. is and on the people who are against God's Okay, so yeah. you know, ano, kasi siyempre wala tayo sa kakayahan pa ngayon. Ano? Wala. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, so ito, uh, may comment. Uh, kaya pala, sabi ni Ate Del na uh, sinunog nila yung custom para ma matabunan o maitago yung uh, mga goods na yan, yung mga traces na yan. Siguro nga, ano? I, 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 I want to add up a little bit. You know, last July, June or July, when we also execute the coup warranto because I adopted Article 8, Judicial, in the Constitution, as the rule of law, I adopted. Mm. We issue the Kuwa Martin, ang Presidente, ang Banko Central, sila lahat, ang Supreme Court, ang LRA, lahat. They received our Kuwa Ranto. You know what they did when when we sent the LRA, our Kuwa Ranto, nasunog ang Bureau of Plans? Remember the right also got Bureau of Lands Records and records ng LRA was yeah, made down yeah. that was July or in, in month of July 2018 mm. Mm. nasunog dahil nag-issue na tayo ng kuwaran to <laughs> yan naman ang yan now, din din sa okay, sige po oh. dahil uh, doon ito naman sa alod yan naman ang kuwaran to and Meaning, bahala na kayo. Anong <laughs> gagawin? Kahit sino pang umupo dyan, inumpakan niyang pera ng bansa, pera uh, ng may-ari, wala na rin niyang value. Bakit? Dahil tapos na eh. Finish. Na. That can only be restored if, kagaya nung naisip ko, Lord, anong gagawin? Kaya, kaya nagdala kami ng letter sa uh, Deutschland to Germany kay mm. President Putin because we want this pera, itong pera pala ng Euro becomes the bridge of other nations to bring peace para ang lupa nila na wala ang lupa nila back to them and then we can, they can print the money again. They will borrow money from us and mm. then they can print money Again, to bring world peace. Mag-umpisa dito. Ito pala ang purpose ng perang yan. Para ang other nation can connect. Like Zimbabwe right now is suffering. They could have been reconnected with us. Iraq, the same thing. That's Anyone right. who prints, you have to realize this. Anyone who prints gold certificate die. Sino yan? You uh, si sino pa yon yung sa Fidel Castro o oh, hindi 
yung isang ah uh, isang Arabo ah uh, dalawa silang nation na nagprint ng pera they are all dead Marcos print gold currency yung ang bagong lipunan what happened he got overthrown he died too actually ah uh, the 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 Marcos that they have known since 86 is a clone Mm. There are six, seven clones of Marcos, okay? Mm. So, nga, pag, so, so, that's pag, the thing. Interesting yan, interesting yan. One, 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 one interesting topic that we could... Yeah, so, uh, yan, po ang, katu- yan po ang katotohanan. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, so, itong, kung marirecover natin yan, mag- eh, magkano po ba yung indemnification na inihingi ninyo? Uh, na Alam mo, natin? it really doesn't matter to me kung magkano eh. Ang ano na lang diyan kung magkano na lang ibigay nila dahil i-cancel ko nga ang debt nila eh. So actually nakakos ng suffering ng mga Pilipino people dapat sila. Talagang masilutan ah, masilutan din sila ba? Dili ginato na sila dapat pakawalan. We should not right. let them go free in the street. So, ang ano nitong perang ito actually My gold yan eh. There is a gold backup and that will be remunerated. Kaya nga ngayon ang mga bangko nagsara eh. Nagkaroon sila ng uh, system check para yeah, uh, right. kung paano nila ma- magkaroon na maging bangko uli sila. Dahil all banks are all on status quo. Bankrupt mm-hmm. lahat ng bangko. At kayong mga kapatid ko dyan na may marami kayong pera alis kasi Revelation 3.18 God said buy gold from me so you will still be rich kasi Jeremiah 16 13 ang sabi din in three years the wealth of Moab becomes poverty wala na at sa Israel naman Uh, dito naman sa Pilipinas at ang sabi niya nakasulat sa Isaiah 17:4 mawala rin ang bisa ang pera natin pero iilan lang ang magkakaroon so anong suggestion niyo so, have it redeem so anong suggestion niyo kung halimbawa yung mga kaibigan nating may mga naka may savings sa bangkong malaki eh kunin uh, na nila dahil talagang wala na ring bisa eh kasi wala na ring visa, kunin na rin lang nila. Si, kahit na sila na lang ang magsunog, o kaya, baka sakaling magamit pa nila, igastos na lang nila, ipamigay nila, o kaya mag-redeem din sila ng gold dollar certificate. Uh, okay. Dahil who owns the land, owns the gold. And the only, the only one that can print money is a legitimate government. Now, I also uh, heard that Union Bank are also trying to get the cryptocurrency. Brothers yes, and yeah. sisters, cryptocurrency, electronic currency is a threat of national security. Hindi kayo siyang ayon dyan sa cryptocurrency, my, my queen. Dahil ano yan eh, that is created chips lang yan. Walang value, walang, walang pundo po yan. Mm-hmm. Kaya hindi ako ano, that's against the rule of law. Mm-hmm. And that is against the penal code. Tingnan nila ang penal code. Republic Act 3815. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yan. Kung gusto nyo makriminalize kayo, o makulong din kayo, o kaya magalit ng Diyos sa'yo, patayin din kayo, no. Inyo din yun, that's your choice. Okay. Sa akin naman, ginawa ko lang naman, batas sa batas lang eh. Sa lupa, sa tao, at sa Diyos. Yan Yung ang akin sa ito. Kayo nagpiprint kayo ng pera. Wala namang yeah. wala namang kayo na receive na reaction from the government or from the central bank. Wala naman ano? Wala naman na kasi ako. ano ma, ano magawa nila? Corporate sila and I am a sovereignty. At at saka ni execution ko na kinuklos ko na ang bangko nila. Wala naman silang karapatan talaga sa aking pagsabihan uh-huh. ako eh. Kasi, Pero natanggap nila, natanggap nila ang ating pera. Yes. Kasi may nakasulat yan sa decision under civil case 3937P that all gold belonging to the United Nations Federation and in the archipelago and in any government belongs to the crown. Okay. So anong magawa mo? Wala. 
Kaya naghahanap ba ako? Hindi. Bakit? Ang, marami, ang ginamit marami. ko ngayon, ang Federal Reserve System, World Settlement, kung hindi ko gagamitin yon sinong gagamit? At ang no. ginto, nasa akin naman talaga, ang lupa nasa akin din. Oh. Mm -hmm. So, well, hindi problema. So, I don't know why you have to seek money or the fiat money or ang ginto when I have it. Ang wala sa akin, ang tao, hinahanap ko ang mga kasamahan ko, ang mga taong gintong tao na magiging katulong natin sa pagtayo ng bagong gobyerno sa inang bayan, underground zero, at kung sino man ang mag-participate nan, we will grant them back the land. Iyon lang, oh. maisama natin sila. Kasi ito yes. naman para sa mga taong uh, nakakaintindi, gusto magkipagkaisa sa uh, para sa inang bayan at mamamayan. Uh, napakaganda. And, so, uh, so, maraming so, salamat po sa inyong lahat. Maraming salamat po sa inyo. Uh, my uh, Her Royal Highness, Queen Salvation, Ligaspi, Espiritu Santo para po sa panahon na inyo pong iniukol para sa wealth of the nation. And especially to you, uh, Ka Anton, maraming salamat sa iyo because kung wala ka, then the rest of the could not have been heard about this uh, issue na ito'y talagang matagal na nilang hinahanap na I hope medyo nalinawagan na rin po sila. Maraming salamat po sa iyo. Sige, patuloy po kayo. Susunod po. Magandang gabi. Maraming 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 salamat po sa walang sawang pagtangkilik at pagsuporta sa The Filipino Times featuring The Divine Legitimate Government, Kingdom Philippine Hacienda, The Sovereign Host Nation. Kami po ay lubos na nagpapasalamat sa walang sawang pagsubaybay sa aming mga programa sa pagsiwalat ng katotohanan. Nao po tayo po ay magkaisa para po sa isang layunin upang maitaguyod ang inang bayan bilang isang makatao, makajos makabansa at makakalikasan, malaya at nagkakaisa. Maraming salamat po. Introducing the KFH Browser. Let's all fight the conspiracy and figures together by downloading the KFH Browser now. Enjoy and experience lightning speed browsing with this KFH modified lightning browser by Mozilla, featuring the divine legitimate government, Kingdom Filipina Hacienda, the sovereign host nation, embedded the reliable source of information as primary bookmarks for you to get the latest updates exclusively from our websites. This is now available for all Android users with a simplified user-friendly interface. No advertisements, hassle-free, and absolutely free. Fast and secured. What are you waiting for? Download now. Introducing the KFH Browser.